and all the men are very protective of her. Right, okay. Life in a plastic bag. It's the best you've ever had, no, it's a plastic bag. There is nothing left for you, so you go back to your glue. You promise your mum and your friends you never go back to that glue again. But times got rough and things got bad. All you wanted was that plastic bag. Drinkers form groups known as drinking schools. Each person buys drink for all the others on the day he or she cashes their gyro. It's a kind of informal banking system, 
and many of these drinking groups have reformed in the wet house. Rob is part of one which has functioned every week for several years. I'm on the game, my dear. Thank you, Robbie. No, I'll come back Thursday, you know that. You're lending George's yeah. money? Yes, and you get it back on Thursday. That's when I get my money, because it's normally skimped by Thursday. And I got money off his John here, £20. So I've got to pay him back today. And he'll give me a day on the Monday. And that's how the system works? That's the way we work. I Are work with really three people. There's only a few people that trust each other enough to do it. You know what I mean? because we've known each other for so many years. So when we've got it, we help each other. See, the reason why I lend them it is because if I don't lend them it, I'll have nothing. I'll drink it. So if I lend it, I know I've got something to come back. Now it's like a shark. Come on, get in. Sit anywhere you like, anybody. If you take one day at a time, you can't look back, you can't look forward, you can look for the present day. And when you look at the present day and you think and you say to yourself, Well I've got something to do to something and when I do it, I'll do it right. And when I do it right, I know for a fact, it's always welcome back. Did you have a family, Rob? I've got the two of them here. Stephen and Johnny, and that's my wife's name, Joyce. She was never short for money. But I got sick when she was miserable. And she said to me, she said, yeah. she said, I'll never forget it. I never won't. She said, I don't like your face. So I said, why? I said, you love me. I said, I met her in the Strand Palace Hotel. She was a waitress. So you know what I did was, I said, well, I'm a way out. I didn't tell that personal. I said, I'm a way out. I never went back. I drink between eight and nine of these cans a day. That's very strong lager. And that's made of caviar fish, fish eggs, and beef. Come all you maidens, young and fair. Come all you women in your prime. Always beware and keep your garden fair. Let no one steal your time away. For time it is a precious thing and time brings all things to your mind always beware and keep your garden fair let no man steal your time away
dad. Ah, Danish bacon walk. One moment. Can I have a biscuit, Joe? Yeah. Can I make a sandwich? Yeah. And what about one of these sweets? Yeah. Sweets? Tampax Compact is so discreet and so small that you won't even realise it's a tampon. Sweets? I don't have any. <coughs> Tampax Compact. Made to go unnoticed. <laughs> It's the most cushiony soft toilet paper there is. Have you heard what's new from Frisky's Winnerlot? An easy to open, easy to serve pack that seals in freshness and taste. Frisky's Winnerlot Simply Fresh. Simply serve. Mm. 
when I go from the side, I spread the no blood and everything. Right, okay. But oh. I was in hospital over that before. Were I was you? In hospital. They, did they sort that out for you? They did not, no. And I'm still waiting for it. When drinkers are sleeping rough, they make frequent use of hospital, accident and emergency departments. Here in the hostel, they're properly registered with a local practice and a doctor visits every week. Hi Brian. she'd like to try living independently and a flat has been found for her. She wants to move but her friends are worried about whether she'll be able to cope on her own.
I have to beg. Y'all know street life is not very nice. I won't wish you on my worst enemy come to think about it. That's how bad it is. It's not nice, Penny. I'm telling you. They're trying to get me into detox. Ooh, what's my orange juice in this please? There's me bop. Do you want to go into detox? Well, I don't know if it's going to work really, to tell you the truth. I've drank so many years, I don't know if it'll work. And why do you think you were drinking like that when you were so young? Because my mother said to me, my brother died when he was 18 months old, right? He died of a hole in his heart. I was a mistake. You're not my daughter. I never wanted you in the first place. You're just an accident in the back seat of a car. I think it was five when my mother said that to me. And I never forgot them words. This is where Annette slept before coming into the safety of the wet house. All the residents had suffered terrible injuries on the streets often from ordinary citizens who enjoy inflicting violence without fear of repercussions. Nobody was arrested for what happened to Michael. What happened to your hand? Well, I got something on fire. You were set on fire? Yes, not the same man. Near Providence Roof. There's an old house on the corner, over from Providence Roof. And uh, to see me coming in to the business, like, uh, so they asked me to have any drink, which I did. So I was going to tell them that. And I heard them up the stairs. And then they came in and uh, kicked the door in. How oh, big a room is this? That's when they did kick the door in. Like, uh, I don't sit down. But then they pour this liquid stuff on the floor and start to strike matches. So the whole place went up. And fire, like I don't know what it was, what type of uh, material it was, but it was very effective. And I seen him coming in, I didn't know it was him. Three stories high, in flames. I jumped. You must have been in a lot of pain. Horrible. I had to put him out to save his life and I had been burnt to death. It was me who saved his life. At that time, I didn't know it was him. I was that black. We were in flames. He threw a coat over it. Look at his hands. Look at range. They're all crushed and I'm like, what? I'm not a young man. I'm not a young man, but he's even over me. He's even over than me. He's over than me. I am. Yes. Yes. I am. He's 61. 51. I'm a blue nose, yes. He's a blue nose. He's a carly bee. A man in fire. You don't... Ignore a person. You don't bother what religion he is. You save his life. And I'm the man that done it. No, he's all right. Tommy, what's the Irish trouble for you? Because you're from Belfast, you're Protestant, and Sean's from the Republic. 
Doesn't matter how many of us. He's a Catholic. I'm a Protestant. John John was a Catholic. I'm a Protestant. Doesn't matter this. I don't bear with me an everything in my Take me home to I'll celebrate me right I don't mind rain. You pick a temple man. Here lies a soldier of the Yuki. on nursing or returning to nursing call 0845 60 60 655. Sweat. Sure for men won't let you down. Mm-hmm. 
Jane came in and said, I'm stressed. Calm down, I said. How can I, this dry scalp's itchy, sensitive type and dreading flakes? I said, you need head and shoulders soothing shampoo for dry scalp. Unlike ordinary conditioners and hot oil treatments, it's specifically designed to stop dry scalp and even dandruff. Two weeks later, she said, all is calm. Calms your scalp, controls dandruff, head and shoulders soothing for dry scalp. Wear your hair with pride. Wilkinson Sword gives you the edge. The sharpest edges in the world. With Alpha Diamond coated blades and ultra fine guard wires, there's no sharper, safer wet shave. Protector 3D Diamond from Wilkinson Sword. Sitting in my huge leather armchair watching telly and thinking how marvelous it would be to be a werewolf. How fantastic and different my life would be to go beyond human. To be a man dog, a hairy person. Look at me. I am teeth, I am fur, I am dribble. I am the wolf man. Homo wolfus! My rocket is made from pure carbon and smashes through planets. I am Wolfman. I hate being bored and I can punch suns. I am the Wolfman, a huge rancid dog traveling at 5,000 miles per hour. Wolf person, dog boy. I am the universe. I am the brilliant dog. Secret, flesh and blood, bone and sinew. Meet the anatomists. Tuesdays at 10 30. everybody by leaving the hostel and going into detox. We met her again after she'd been in the clinic for a week. And what made you decide to take the plunge then? Um, a few too many trips to hospital, uh, a few too many stitches here and there, um, a few friends in hospital right now that are really good friends of mine, uh, a couple of friends dying. Um, just basically want a better life, I suppose. Had enough. <laughs> Comes a point in time you've had enough. I mean, a lot of people in here are re-offenders. Like, they've tried it and gone out and failed and tried again and failed and tried again and failed. And I don't want to be like that. Like, I'm hoping I can just do it and stick with it. Because um, it does get kind of discouraging when you see people sitting there saying, well, I tried it before, but it didn't work. I've tried it before and it didn't work. I've been in here 13 times now. And you're going like, oh, <laughs> you know, it doesn't give you a very good outlook as in making it. But I think you've got to be positive about it. We returned to the wet house to find that the residents had just been informed that Big Sean had died early that morning. I 
that himself. And he was the one hard man. I miss him. I miss him a lot. He's a terrible kid. The threats we used to make each other. <laughs> He's a threat and he's worse on terrible. On the wall by the boss. Sit there with Ken and all that, yeah. Me. So for him. The big one. I call him the big one, didn't I? Yeah. yeah. That was his nickname from from that. I called him the big one. John. Yeah. Because he's a good friend of ours. And when you get to know people with a lot of family, these are a better family than your own family. Because everybody helps one another out. When we ain't got nothing, or fag, or something like that, someone will always come over and give you a fag, or a drink. All right, we know we're all alcoholics. That's why we're here. Residents were still reeling from the news of Sean. But this was also the day in which Jamie was moving to her new flat. The flat is only a bus ride away, and they'd arranged for a carer from the hostel to help her every day, but Jamie was still jittery about living alone.
anyway. May the Lord. I'll have you out for a miss. Bye, Dolly. I'm going to miss you, babe. Come on, there you go. All right. You see, God, I told you. I love you all. I know. I love you. We all love you. We love you at all. You feel right, Jimmy. We all love you. Come on, If you or someone close to you is having problems with alcohol or substance abuse, there's a Channel 4 recorded information line with information and details of organisations on 0870 You can also ask confidential questions at the Health House on channel4.com slash health.